For our wooden horse activity, we'll need our three popsicle sticks, two clothespins, scissors, and glue. Our first step is going to be taking two of our three popsicle sticks and cutting them down to size. Our first step is going to be taking two of our three popsicle sticks and cutting them down to size. We want to cut them so they're about three inches long. And you can cut them individually. It will probably be easier. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two pieces and I'm going to glue these two together. So the two pieces I cut just going to stick a little glue on the side to put these together. I'm going to take our two leftover pieces from our belly and I'm going to cut these down to size. One will be our neck and one will be our head. So I'm going to cut the neck to be just a little bit shorter than my regular popsicle sticks that I have for our belly. So that's about good for the neck. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut our other piece down to size to make our head. And now we're going to glue these two together as well. So first I'm going to take our glue and put a little bit on our two pieces that are glued together already. Here's my neck and I'm going to add the horse's head that we cut that was a little bit smaller. So here's the head. So now what we'll have to do is we'll have to make an ear and a tail for our horse. We have one full popsicle stick so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and I'm just going to cut a corner of the popsicle stick to be our ear. You can try to make it triangle-like. So this is our ear, so I'm going to glue this on. And your ear is going to be really small, just in the corner of the horse's head. So let me put that on. And then we'll work on our tail. So I'm going to take our leftover popsicle stick and I'm just going to make a few pieces for our tail. So I'm just going to do a few cuts and then I'm going to cut across and you'll see that I'll get a couple wooden pieces that I'll be able to attach. So I have these pieces that I cut out for our horse's tail. So I'm going to add some glue at the end of our horse and then I'll just need to attach these pieces. So I'm just going to use three pieces for our tail. I don't need to go crazy with it. There we go. So our horse's tail is together, its head, neck, ear, and body is together. So our next step We'll just be propping our horse up with our clothespins. So I'm going to take my clothespins and I'm going to put the horse together just like this so our horse will be able to stand.